everyone. My name is James Bellissimo. I'm Baroque Town Manager, and I'm here to provide some updates for this month. A lot going on, uh, very busy, a lot of great progress, and I've been happy to report to you. First thing on the agenda today is the Maine Water update. Maine Water has assumed operations for the, water, water, the Berwick Water Department, and that includes operating the plant and also includes customer service. They began, began the operations side on February 2nd, and it's been a very smooth transition. And the customer service side will, it's already happened. Um, the transition's happening, it's begun, but they will take over those op, the customer service side later this month. So the next billing cycle, next bill you'll receive is in April and it'll actually come with Maine Water um, letterhead on it, and the bill will come from Maine Water. So you'll be sending the bills to Maine Water as well. Payments can be made by check, and they can also be paid online, and the good news is there's no card transaction fees. You can also set up automatic billing as well. All rates, terms and conditions, and existing payment arrangements will continue to be set by the Town of Berwick and honored by the Town of Berwick. If you have any questions on this transition, feel free to give me a call or email. I'll be happy to um, talk through it with you. So it's budget season, and we have several meetings coming up with the select board. On February 14th, 21st, 28th, and possibly March 7th, we need it. So you'll be able to follow along the budget process. That will be um, voted on. Uh, in June. We have several bids and RFPs, requests for proposals on our website. We have bid requests for a 1997 Freightliner with a commercial cab, and we have a minimum bid on that for $20,000. If you'd like to bid on that, please send your sealed bill bid in the mail to 11 Sullivan Street and address it, Town of Berwick Vehicle Bid. One of the requests for proposals we have, we have a series of masonry work that we need around Town Hall. If you're a mason or know a mason, please send your proposals our way. Um, we're looking forward to getting some needed work done. We also have a request for proposals out for playground equipment at Memorial Field. So that will be moving along uh, this spring into the summer. We have a Brief update on town growth. We saw 22 new single family houses built in 2022. And the five year average, including 2022, is 27.4, which is a pretty steady rate, um, especially compared to, we've seen some pretty drastic highs and lows. Um, this is a pretty sustainable level to meet the housing needs of our community and not overburden our systems. Um, we have now we have fewer children in the school system than in, from 1989, and that's due to North Berwick and Lebanon sending fewer children into the school system. 2002 was our peak. We had 3,270 combined. Now we have just under 3,000. I'd like to recognize um, the Berwick Library and Berwick for a Lifetime again for the work they're doing with programming. They're doing a sand bucket program. So they're identified some seniors who've signed up to request deliveries for sand. And they've picked it up at Public Works and delivered it. There's also a meal delivery program. And the library has opened up twice recently as a warming shelter. Um, so they're doing wonderful things at the library. Um, speaking of warming shelter, We've had a couple major weather events, and we strongly encourage you to sign up for rave alerts. One of the quickest and easiest ways is to text York County Alerts, it's all one word, to the phone number 226-787. You get updates on important weather updates, shelter, shelter uh, news, and other important announcements. Um, to go along with that, um, they can send out a, a voice call so 
if this sounds like something you're interested in, if you have any issues signing up, just feel free to email me or call me. I'd be happy to walk you through that. Uh, brief update on the lift. It's been a long time coming. And this upcoming Tuesday, we'll, I'll be making a recommendation to the select board on a lift for the auditorium. And soon after that, we can order it and have it delivered. And it's a 10 to 12 week lead time from there to get that delivered and installed. And last I have, Envision Berwick has been doing uh, a ton of work lately. There's openings on Envision Berwick. There's Dig a Hole One subcommittee, which is focused on downtown infrastructure and downtown streetscaping and making our downtown walkable. There's also an Agriculture Resilience and Sustainability Committee that's recently started. Uh, lawn Chairs 2023 will begin planning soon. There's Economic Development Initiatives, and as I mentioned, Berwick for a Lifetime. So if you're interested in getting involved with that, please email envisionberwick at gmail.com. And as usual, uh, my door is open most of the time, and you can email me or call me and be happy to talk with you about anything you have in mind. So thanks again for your time. Bye. Thanks.